When I was a barrister, I loved it. I mean, I adored getting dressed up in my wig and gown and going to court and having a having a, an argument or two with uh, with the bench or my opponent. But every so often, I found that uh, I was absolutely surprised that somebody would come along and absolutely whack me, and they were so much better than me at the law. And I really couldn't work out what it was until I realised that I was actually passionate, much more passionate about something else than the law. At this stage I was running uh, the, the pub, my grandfather had died and, I, and my mum and dad were, wanted to sell the leasehold which was the only pub the family had and I said don't sell it, I want to run it. So I went and ran it whilst I was working as a barrister and my wife and I would go and uh, run it on, on the weekend as well and she would see some of her criminal law clients uh, up there and I'd see some people I'd represent up there as well and, and it was a very busy life. And I realised that when I was in chambers um, and doing my work that I wouldn't be thinking about my law, I'd be thinking about what I was going to do at the pub that night. How would I change it? What would I do with the music? What would I do with the, with the, with the wine selection? What sort of cocktail would I put on tonight? And so I really tried to reinvent that pub. And it was the first pub that really made a generational change in Sydney, in Darlinghurst. So I, I took out all the ports and sherries and I replaced them with table wines and I put on entertainment and I put flowers around the bar and I put on cocktails and, and put on young uh, bar attendants and, and lo and behold, the pub changed. It had a generational change and it was got busy and uh, I loved it. So whilst I was working as a barrister in my chambers, my mind would keep on drifting over to the pub and I realised I was much more passionate about the pub than I was about law. And as I said at the time, I made the change from a legal bar to the public bar, and I've never looked back. <laughs>